I ended up hiking a lot further than I had planned to because there just wasn't a good place to camp. I uh, found a tree, a couple of trees went behind them, and the voila, a cleared camp spot. There's no comments in that on uh, about that on gut hugs. So I left a comment, and it was a pretty good spot. We actually got some decent sleep last night compared to the last like week of nights have not been great. And it didn't get horribly cold. It was very comfy. And yeah, and the stars are pretty. I saw the Milky Way. It was, uh, and I had a little bit of service too. So I was able to text some friends and family and stuff. So I'm in Pie Town now. Just gotta look for a house with an excessive amount of toasters. That is a lot of toasters. All the pie shops in town are apparently closed today, but one of them had um, uh, brought all their leftover pies, since they're closed for a few days, to the toaster house last night. And I had one of two choices, custard and cherry, so I got one of each. The chair I'm sitting in is a um, seat of a car, and it still has a seatbelt. I was told if I sit here, I have to buckle up. <laughs> It's a scientific instrument, I guess. Mm -hmm. And they have a, you know, a healthy fence around it, and if somebody's here and the, and the gate's open and you walk in, they will come out and tell you to get out. So it's, it's banned 24-7 then? Uh, no, somebody's on 24-7 call. They used to have somebody here always from Monday to Friday, kind of regular working hours, technician, but there's always somebody on call. And some of them left the gate open and were friendly, and if the door was open, I could call in case somebody knew what they were talking about and wanted to talk to me. They were really friendly, and they let them come in, and, um, and nobody's here anymore. It's really hard to get people to work. The guy that worked the longest, of course, lived here. So we are hurtling and whirling. I was really not expecting to see something like this up here. And it's just beautiful. And you're going to... Um, and there's, there's one at both sides of the port. I'm taking down all the windmills when I moved here in 80, and so he moved them here, and he left the truck there. That window doesn't go down on um, the back one. And he left that truck there. It's called a gin rig, and you can see. Got an awesome tour of Pie Town by Nita, who runs the toaster house. I uh, went with Slowpoke. <laughs> pie in Pie Town. That's what her bumper sticker says. <laughs> This town is known for its pie, pies and pie festivals, and I enjoy how all the signs here say something relevant. Oh, there's a Festival Lane, Custard Avenue over there, there's Apricot Avenue. I bet all of them have some sort of pie filling name. <laughs> I tried really hard to pet them. They were sitting against the fence, but they all left when I approached. <sighs> I feel so rejected. We just got some Trail Magic oranges from the owner of the TLC ranch. He's driving away. <laughs> Is he making smell? What are you? We've been seeing these a lot. There's butts up in the air. <laughs> 